Today we're going to use copper pipe and 3D printers to make a media console. This video is sponsored by LG and I'm featuring the 4K wallpaper thin 55 inch LG E9 OLED TV. The unique floating design is created by a glass bezel that the TV rests on. This is a really cool design feature that gives it that floating minimalist look. The OLED technology allows this TV to be wallpaper thin with an incredible picture quality. And I'll tell you a little bit more about this TV at the end of the video. The majority of this project is going to be made out of half inch copper pipe. I've been experimenting a lot with copper pipe recently. It's relatively cheap. I love the way it looks and it presents an interesting design challenge because it's not that strong. So I'm going to pair it with 3D printed connectors to try to make some modular furniture systems. I'm really enjoying my Pulse 3D printers from Matter Hackers. They're incredibly reliable, the print quality is excellent, and the interfaces are all easy to figure out. The connectors I'm designing have round holes in them that allow the copper pipes to slide in. They also have these hexagonal recesses that allow me to insert these 3D printed hexagonal plugs so that they won't rotate too much when they're all aligned. Now I could just glue these together, but instead I 3D printed in holes that allow me to insert a quarter inch threaded rod so I can just clamp these all together with some nuts. The result is a system that allows me to make custom copper trusses by stringing these joints together and then clamping them down nice and tight. Now, currently I don't think this is the most practical way to make furniture, but 3D printers are only gonna get better, so I kind of wanna be experimenting now so as the technology consistently improves and becomes more affordable and accessible, I'll have a bunch of ideas that are ready to go. So think of this as a rough draft. And if you're really into 3D printing, be sure to check out some of my other 3D printed projects. I'll put links to them in the description box below. I printed all of these out of PLA, which is a relatively soft type of plastic, but it's really easy to use. It's rare that you ever get an error with it, and it's a lower priced filament. If I wanted them to be stronger, I would print them out of nylon filament, which luckily my Pulse 3D printer is compatible with. I use Gorilla Clear construction adhesive to glue the copper pipes into the brackets. Now, if I was going to do this again, I probably would have printed in holes in the brackets and then drilled holes in the copper and used screws to fix it. That way it'd be easier to take it apart and put it back together again. That being said, the construction adhesive worked just fine. Once I got the base assembled, I called in my buddy Mike Montgomery from Modern Builds to help me hold the pieces in place while I put in the top pieces. Mike is also working with LG and he did a really cool media console made out of plywood. I'll put a link to that in the description box below. The console was starting to take shape and I really liked the way it looked, but it was a little bit wobbly. So I printed these clamps that go around three of the copper pipes at a time, and then I can just use bolts to secure them really tight. And that stiffened up the whole thing. Now, I knew that the copper would become stronger if it was all clamped together really tightly. And I learned this from a previous project where I made a bench out of copper pipe with concrete legs. These brackets will also serve as the base for these pieces of marble tile that I'm gonna use for the top of the console. And there you have it, a really futuristic media console made out of copper, 3D printed filament, and Carrera marble. So now it's time to test it out while I tell you a little bit more about the sponsor for this video. LG makes this incredible 4K wallpaper thin 55 inch E9 OLED TV. The LG E9's unique floating design is created by a glass bezel that creates a firm base for the TV while giving it a modern and minimal aesthetic. Typically TVs need to be mounted on the wall to create this look and it's really cool that LG figured out a easier way. The OLED technology allows the TV to be wallpaper thin but still have 4K HDR resolution. So you can experience the perfect black and infinite contrast that really brings out shadow detail and sharpness like never before and true-to-life images with richer color. 
This LG TV doesn't just look great, it also has exceptional sound quality provided by the Dolby Atmos surround system, which sounds great and takes advantage of LG's AI capabilities. The E9 uses spatial recognition technology to learn about the space that it's in and then fine tune the settings to create the ultimate home cinema experience. To learn more about the LG E9 TV, click on the link in the description box below. Thank you LG for sponsoring this video and thank you for watching it. Yeah, pretty thin. Check out some of our other projects and don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. Thanks, bye.